So this morning, I'm here at the Batawi Waterfalls, my little happy place. <laughs> and this morning, I'm here in my boots. I'm going to look at the plot. When I begin work today, tomorrow, I will bring you guys visuals about this place. But I'm here with my mama, and we are about, you know, your own pa. <laughs> Greetings from Patawi Waterfalls, Liberia, Bone County. Remember, I told you guys there's a project going on, right? I shared it on my page. It's about a rice project that's about to begin at the Patawi Waterfalls, Liberia. Um, they're about to carry on a rice corn, you know, plants grow their own things. At Patawi Waterfalls, we grow what we eat. Yeah, so I'm here this morning. Actually, tomorrow we'll, um, the team will be here to work. And tomorrow, y'all will see me also. Mm. I'll be in the field also. So, yep, I mean, I live what I preach. The experience, everything. I want to get it. So, I'm here this morning just to view the plot, to see what it's like, what, what's been happening, and where they are now. And what will be tomorrow? So yeah, I'm here in my rainbow sun. So don't go there. <laughs> Super ready. <laughs> we'll be stepping up in all of this tomorrow. So let me turn the camera around so that you can see what I'm talking about, okay? And we have something going on here with the machine. It got stuck. So they brought the other machine to come and pull it up. But yeah, that's what's up. Yeah, more man. Just the plot here already. So that one over there that rest the plane there already. Yeah, yeah, uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. But that's just a that walk to the rest where they already planted the rice. And let's see, yeah. I think Labura can do a lot. We're farming. We have a very rich soil. Like, very rich. We can grow so many things in Liberia. In Liberia, like, we don't even run out of anything. Every season that comes, we got some fruit. Every season, dry season, we got something. Rainy season, we got something. In the middle season, we got something going. Fertile land. I wish we could realize actually what we have and make use of it. Yeah. So they got some rice here. Already they planted. So they're about to pull that thing up. Oh my god. So okay. Let's try to get down. I want to show you guys. <laughs> yeah. So if you haven't seen rice, how it looks like. This is how it looks like. Are you just planting it? This is what it looks like. Let's go back to the soil. Let's go back to the soil. Liberia is a fertile land fertile country that we have so much we have this country is so blessed oh my god this country is so blessed every season you have something you have a fruit you have something we, we don't run out of anything in liberia rainy season we got something some kind of food going on dry season we got something going on every every time of the year you'll find something that's a blessing so why don't we you know make use of what we have going back to the soil plants grow labra should be exporting rice as our staple food and we can't even grow it <laughs> instead we're looking out to other people to be buying importing and you know rice business in Liberia, you not funny? So that's something we should have even paid attention to. 
because that's our simple food and Liberian men are rest business look we can eat anything in a day during the day if we taste that one spoon of rice a janitor to say we eat yet so why can't we focus on that eh? and grow it we have vast land Liberia is so green the greenery look this country is blessed oh my god I wish we knew what we had hmm. mm. this country is so blessed the greenery the greenery like in most of my videos you hear me talking about the greenery the greenery because that's what we have in Liberia the greenery if only we could focus on that prioritize it man Liberia will stand out there will be some superpower around here rice that was staple food but we're not growing rice instead we importing and when it finish then you see all crying when they raise the price from i don't know 12 to 13 or 20 dollars you see all crying all over the place but we could grow it though some people don't like our country rice but i think that's the sweetest the sweetest tastiest rice that we have the country rice but i think it will take us time to get there to appreciate what we have yeah it will take us time and we're praying for that day we're praying for that day <laughs> yeah 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 it feels so good just being a part of something seeing the birth the birth of it the growth of it you know seeing the growth of it moving moving from one stage to another like adding up today you were here and then the next day you see something else that was added progressively positively just building up building up it feels good to be part of that and i'm glad i'm part of this family the Patawi Waterfalls family. I'm glad to be a part of it. <laughs> I'm very glad. I'm truly glad. I'm glad they gave me the opportunity to serve <laughs> my country. My own country. Because this is one of Liberia's, you know, stuff. One of Liberia's thing. Liberia. We are talking about Liberia, not just, you know, one entity or something. Liberia. I'm proud. Very, very proud. To be a part of it to brand my country to sell it out there to the world i am proud and yep i am if you're out there you ain't find a brand ambassador for your business yet you better hit delisha up because with delisha you get the full package plus profit I give my heart and soul to anything that I do. You won't regret, trust me. And I have an engaging platform. My people, I mean, I love them so much. I cherish them, I appreciate them. And yes, we have a lot of interaction between us. I love that. Shout out to my explorers. A big, big shout out. I love you people, cross my heart. I love you. <laughs> Let me show you my boots I'm wearing, yeah? <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> Look, this place just makes me happy. I feel calm. I feel energized. Every time I come here and I go back to Monrovia, I feel a new wave of energy. Yeah, so energized. So pumped up for work. <laughs> But oh, y'all see my rain boots now. Boots in boots, boots in boots, boots in boots. Delicia in boots, delicia in boots. <laughs> boots in boots, delicia in boots. Boots in boots, delicia in boots. Somebody say they won't, yeah? <laughs> she can't be serious. Look, life is too short. Life is too short. I'm coming to any serious thing. They give me no award for being too serious. Now that they're giving award for being too, you know, free or something, but I will choose 
playfulness, being free over being too serious. I ain't got no time for that. When I drop today and die, that it. Nobody will live that other life for me. So, the way I'm still living, let me enjoy my life. Eh? Be grateful to God for blessing me with life. Move on with my life. So long I'm not insulting anybody. I'm not getting on anybody's way. I'm not being the, the cause, you know, for bread to move from on the next man's table. Just minding my business that pays me and doing what I got to do. Representing my country, my family, my people, myself positively. That's all that matters to me. Putting God first in everything. That's all that matters. Every other thing, me being playful. I ah, mean, I said looking young to do. You can't take the serious cap and put it on my head. No. And I think they didn't give me a war for that thing there. Yeah. And plenty of people who can be, be doing this too serious thing. They can want to bring out a little childish thing that in them. Because everybody, every human being we got our little inner child in us. It's just how we channel it, that's all. But for me, I will never let that thing to die in me. Mm -mm. I will play. I will, when you see me and my son playing with each other, say, you will never believe it. Yes, I am a mother. I am a wife. Yep. We just keep certain things out of, you know, the cameras and stuff. But yep. And I have a family. Mm -hmm. When you see us, you see us joking. You be like, ah, they people said a serious family, yeah? We are, but we're not taking anything too serious. Life is too short. Enjoy yourself, live, live. Oh, look at this. Just look at this, look at this. This is what's going to happen here, all my people. Wow. Says Joe, yes, so what are we going to? something tomorrow i came to see here uh -huh. because i need to block this water okay i need to flood this pond i need to flood that bed flood this one mm -hmm. and flood this then the, the power tiller the, the the tractor can get inside and plow it okay to make it ready for planting for planting yeah so if i flood it it will be easier than the tractor don't fish okay so okay. you will just stir the soil uh -huh. and then i will come back and prepare it for planting just like this. Okay. So all of these are ready to plow. Okay. But the key to it is flooding it with water. Uh -huh. So the, the, the tires don't get stuck, the blade don't get stuck. Alright. Hmm? So if, so now today I'm gonna try and flood it as much as I can. All of these are ready. Okay. So then, the ones where in front of the umpire they're ready for planting already? Yes, those three okay. I will be they're ready. They're okay. ready. Today I'm gonna soak the rice because I can I will not brought I will not uh, 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 nurse them mm -hmm. because I will not be able to finish it by December. Okay. Why I'm doing that, I don't want to waste time. I want to use that rice so I will have rice so that when we, we are ready to to nurse, we have enough food. We can be looking for food. Mm -hmm. We have food ourselves to be eating and to do the work. Okay. So that rice we're going to put on, we're going to broadcast it. We'll soak it today, tomorrow. We put it on bag. Once it starts to sprout, mm -hmm. then we broadcast it. Okay. And then we'll do a small nursery so that we can come back. The places that I don't pick up, we plug it in. Okay, mm -hmm. that's good. So mm -hmm. you heard it. You heard it. <laughs> oh my God, this is freaking beautiful. Like really, really amazing. Going back to the soil. I feel good. Sunday. Happy Sunday. A blessed new week. If you ain't subscribed yet, please subscribe. Delicia Life and Travel on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Please subscribe. Let's share the work, okay? I love you. Until we see tomorrow and y'all see me in a fan, on a plot, scratching, planting, doing whatever. I love you, okay? Bye. A blessed new week.